what should I do when there are delays in my life? We look at Zachariah and Mary. They continue with their faithful commitment to the things of God, to God and His Word. If there are delays in your life, don't give up your faithful commitment to God and His Word. Continue that. It was when Zachariah was still performing his duties as a high priest, the angel came. As you continue to sing, pray, be faithful to God, pay your tithe, give faithfully, come to church faithfully. That is where your answer will come. In times of delays to your prayers, don't give up your faithfulness towards God and His Word. Number two, when you look at Hannah, what did Hannah do? Hannah went further in prayers before God. And so remember that year, the Bible says, when everybody was enjoying, Hannah alone went to the temple. And the Bible says that he said, I am pouring my heart. Go further. Probably you are praying one hour, go two hours. Probably you are praying 30 minutes, go one hour. Add fasting to it. Don't rely to your prayers. Don't give up. Don't slow down. Hannah went further. Probably she had been praying, but this year, Hannah said, I'm going to pray more than I've been praying. Samson, mommy, they kept hoping for God to bring them the blessing. Keep hoping. Keep keeping your faith. Keep believing in God. Don't give up your faith. What did Daniel do when things were delayed? He never gave up. Hannah went further. For Daniel, he persisted. So when things are delaying in your life, when you are praying and answers are not coming, don't give up the prayer. Persist. Hammer. Hammer. Luke chapter 18, verse 1 downward. Men ought to pray without season. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord answer you. And may the Lord bring down all that must come at this time. And may you give testimonies that will shake the world. In Jesus' name, amen.